Hi, today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be giving an art lesson and we're going to be drawing one of my favorite animals, the American alligator. To start drawing anything, I look for shapes. Alligators have, uh, when I look at an alligator to draw, I'm seeing a lot of ovals. Um, for instance, uh, when I'm talking about shapes, say, take my hand, you see a square, you see a bunch of rectangles making up the fingers. And so an alligator, we would start with an oval body. See that? We're going to make him a fat alligator. Then we draw another oval for his head. I'm going to make these lines a little darker than I normally do. Otherwise it would be light scratches, but for the sake of the video, so you can see better, the lines will be dark. And I can come back and erase. So for the arms of the alligator, we're going to draw another oval here, another oval there, that's his front arm. Claws, we'll just make some claws like that. Same with the back of his leg. We're going to draw his thigh. I guess what would be an alligator calf would come right here. And then same thing, we draw the, the claws. So there you have his leg. Now the tail, the base of the tail is kind of rectangular. So we, we draw that. And then we're going to draw the, the uh, tip of his tail. Come around like this, make that a little higher. Okay, so you see where we are now. Oval, oval, oval. I'm going to draw it a little darker. Now, from where his tail bends right here, we're going to come across with the top of his tail, which is kind of flat. So. And then across his back where the ridges are, there's usually a line going around like that. And then this way too. His eyes we're going to put about right here. And then the back of his, I mean, well, I should say the eye in the back you won't see because of this ridge. His eyes come up so he can look above the water while the rest of his body is in the water. So he can be sneaky. So there's his eyes. Now, alligators, crocodiles, they always have a little smile going. So to do his mouth, you're just going to zigzag like this. And I'll start shaping this next. We're going to come across with this snout. These are just guidelines that we drew earlier. So that it's just to, to help you put things where they need to be till you can come back with your permanent lines. See that? Now, alligators also have real, especially the big ones, they have a real thick necks. So we're gonna put a band going across here. We'll move his, his arm back a little bit. And then the base of his neck is down here. They also have a little ridge behind their eyes right here and another one there. And then we can kind of put a little shape in his snout. Nose. Now we're going to do his bottom jaw. And when it hits his neck, it juts up like so. Now you wouldn't be an alligator without teeth. So we're gonna add a few teeth. Give him some nice choppers there. Uh, now, his snout, I want it to come up a little bit. So we're gonna add a little snout. Now I can come back and clean up some of these lines that I don't need. Take that one out. Everything else is looking okay. All right. Um, 
we're going to put three lines going across his back and those will be the ridges. Next we're going to follow kind of the back of his head here, the little curve, and just keep going like that. Make this line darker so you can see. And you just follow it like that. Coming down his tail, we're going to put some skin there, kind of curve it a little bit. Across the top of his tail, we're going to put nice ridges. Where each line starts, you go to the next one, add in a little crown to it. And you just kind of continue till they meet. Now we're working our way to the tip of the tail and we're just going to put some nice lines kind of on an angle. And again, we scallop it all the way to the tip. Now I can come back and draw these lines darker. We'll work on his back leg now. I wanted his belly protruding a little past his thigh so that that could be more of, of the focal point, that fat belly of his. He's been eating good. And we're going to add some claws. Now we'll come down with some lines here and add a few more because these are smaller. And then we can just kind of draw some lighter lines this way. When you get to the belly of the gator, it's more circles. So we're just going to add a bunch of circles. Give us a nice alligator pattern, alligator hide. The, leg, the uh, front leg, we draw like so. And then I want to curve the line to show that his arm is circular. And we do the same with this. And we can add a few little scales there. That. We'll add a few circles down here to the bottom of the alligator. Now, we need some ridges going across his back, so we, we come to the center here of each square, and you add what looks like a little fish hook. We'll add some to the far side of his back. You want them to be higher on the left starting at the bottom on the right, coming up, and just hooking it. We'll do the same here. Now we go to the next scale. And then across his back, one more set of scales. And on his side, the scales will jut straight out, so they look like little ovals. And we're almost finished our, our drawing. We'll add some lines, darken the mouth, add a nose, going to make his eye all black, leave a little spot to show where the light's shining. And we come across with an eyebrow. At home, you can slow the video down or even pause it while you catch up. We need a few lines going across his tail and maybe just two. And that concludes our lesson on how to draw the American alligator. So I hope you enjoyed the lesson and please post it on hashtag draw with Jose. Look forward to seeing your work. Thank you.